Energy transitions are very complicated. And because they're complicated, uh, they're a bit scary. The International Energy Association states that the world is approaching a pivotal moment in energy history. For the first time, all of their world outlook energy scenarios predict a peak or plateau in global fossil fuel demand. A lot of the models are steering us towards that peak moment, you know, so peak fossil fuel consumption. The IEA says that ongoing geopolitical conflicts, such as Russia's invasion of Ukraine, have permanently changed energy markets and have highlighted the fragility of the world's reliance on fossil fuels. The crisis that is happening now, and the IEA has labeled it a global energy crisis, it's a bad one. It is driving countries to think about energy security. And it is driving countries to think about what are the best investments that we could make in order to ensure that this doesn't happen again. As the world moves away from fossil fuels, the energy supply in Canada will change as renewables expand across the country. We actually have a very considerable, almost a little bit over a quarter of our energy is green energy. The biggest slice in there by far is hydro. Wind and solar are increasing uh, in importance and could continue to increase and we could start to see some substantive contributions. There are technologies out there that can get us where we want to go. It's just a question of picking the appropriate technology for the place and developing them in a way that allows for the people in the area to, to have control and to be able to maintain and, and keep these technologies up.